Good morning from the province of Alicante in Spain. Today we are exploring Guadalest. Let's go! So Guadalest is a pretty little, I guess, mountain town yeah. um, near Alicante, near Benidorm, and it is a medieval town, so there's a lot to shoot here, uh, but it's a bit cold up here. Hey. Yeah, it's windy, it's chilly, way yeah. more colder than Alicante. Yeah, Alicante is on the coast, so it's a bit warmer, genuinely. Uh, however, it's, uh, yeah, I guess kind of an okay day for photos. Yeah, the, cl the clouds actually make it look really cool in the pictures. So yeah, using the shadows, using the landscape and trying to get some big wide angle shots and some telephoto zoom lens shots as well. Alright, so the sun has come back out and that was a perfect drone flight over Guadalest. Really, really nice views and back to 20 degrees and sunny. So yeah, some more aerial photography and I touched on that two videos ago from hiking in the hills around Alicante. So if you want to check out that and my sort of ideas around aerial with drones, check out that video. I will tag it just below. Guadalest is, is, is being chosen like the second most visited town in Spain, little town in Spain. It's between those nice 100 most beautiful towns, small towns again in, in Spain. Uh, and you can see why. It's, uh, we are just surrounded by great uh, landscapes, great nature, and we're just like about 12 kilometers of the sea. So 
some of my photo tips for sort of midday big landscape stuff, uh, heritage towns, is wide angle for sure. Uh, use the shadows if there's clouds um, and try and find a nice composition where you know you've sort of got certain things highlighted and certain things not and then through Lightroom or Photoshop or whatever editing software you're using try and emphasize those shadows while bringing down the highlights and you can also use a gradient filter um, application in Lightroom at least what I use and that sort of takes the digital place of uh, an ND filter. If you have an ND three stop or a nine stop or a graduated filter, then obviously use that. If you don't like me today, then you can put them into your shots uh, post-processing. And maybe I should do a video one day of actually showing how to do that. But uh, that is an option if uh, you know, you've got a lot of shadows and a lot of overexposed areas as well in your landscape shots. So yeah, I think we kind of made the most of it today though and got some great shots exploring Guadalajara. All right, and that is it for us exploring Guadalest. It's a very cute, picturesque town, and yeah, a little touristy, but I think we picked a good day for it. Yeah, um, so thanks for watching. I know this one was a bit shorter, but I hope you liked the vlog, and we will see you on the next one. Bye-bye.